actually when the temperatures outside are as cold as they are. Now we are going to enjoy some sunshine today. A lot of big blue, beautiful blue skies out there this afternoon. So something maybe to look forward to. It is going to be slightly warmer, but still running below average through today. Now that changes on Saturday. We'll keep the sunshine around through most of the day on Saturday. Cold start to the day, but by Saturday afternoon, temperatures actually jumping back closer to average. Our next rain chance on the horizon as it's set to arrive by the end of this weekend. But a live view from Mount Vernon this morning. Sunrise coming up uh, just shy of 630 AM. Looks like everybody's moving along just fine there on I-64, I-57. Clear sky through the overnight hours. And while that is good during the daylight hours at night, that means temperatures drop off very rapidly. And overnight, most of us falling back into the teens. Right now, 13 in Mount Vernon. We've got 16 in Marion. Still low 20s further to the south from Paducah back over near Portageville, Missouri. We've got 17 in McLeansboro, 17 in Harrisburg, 21 in Anna, and 21 as well right now in Cairo. Further to the south into western Kentucky, Clinton, Kentucky at 22, while Tiptonville, Tennessee is at 23. And in the southeast Missouri, Donovan currently at 19 degrees, while New Madrid is at 24, and Cape currently at 21 degrees. A lot of cold air sitting across the middle of the country. As we get onto the western side of high pressure, though, we will gradually start to see a warming trend here over the next couple of days. Des Moines, Iowa at 18 this morning, Kansas City at 16, and to our north, Chicago up I-57 there at 12 degrees. Big area of high pressure right overhead today, and that's going to keep things quiet for the next couple of days. By this afternoon, we'll actually get on the western side of this high. So winds early this morning back out of the north will start to shift more, though, towards the south and southwest by the later part of the day. And here's our next storm system that we're tracking this morning. It's still off the west coast there and out into the Pacific Ocean, but actually already starting to bring some rain into southern California, and that is a southern track storm system, meaning we're not expecting much to make it its way over the Rockies. By the time it works its way here, we are going to be once again on the warm side, meaning rain is back in the forecast by the end of this weekend. High pressure in control today and through the day on Saturday. A couple high clouds possible late in the day on Saturday, but by Sunday morning, lots of clouds moving in. Notice the rain is still to our west. Rain should hold off until at least the later part of the afternoon on Sunday, but a lot of wet weather expected by Sunday night and into Monday morning as this storm system moves on through. There is a chance by lunchtime or so on Monday afternoon, we could see a break from some of the rain, but as the cold front itself approaches Monday night, expecting those rain chances then to ramp back up. And while it's not a major rain event, expecting another half an inch to an inch on average across much of our region. More and more signs that we could see some of the heaviest rain to our west and to our northwest through this event. Uh, again, that comes in here Sunday and into Monday. 40 degrees is going to do it for a high temperature today. A lot of sunshine around, hardly a cloud in the sky. And this evening, we'll keep the clear skies around. But again, what that means is by the evening hours, uh, temperatures already falling back into the upper 20s by 9 and back into the mid 20s by midnight. Looking ahead to Saturday, 49 degrees. A lot of sunshine still around on Saturday. By Sunday, though, rain chances coming in the later part of the day. At least it's going to be on the mild side. Temperature running about 50 degrees on Sunday afternoon. Even warmer temperatures temperatures by Monday, but all of that wet weather sticks around through the day on Monday. It will be a bit breezy. We'll cool back a few degrees behind the cold front Monday night and into Tuesday. Tuesday afternoon, high temperature only 49, but another system on the way for the middle of next week brings a chance for a mixture of some rain, possibly switching over to some light snow. Yes, that is that stubborn S word that a lot of folks have been maybe trying to find this winter, but at this point, not expecting major accumulations. Looks like anything that would fall should be on the light side for the middle of next week. You Evie's know, just I over here. I know through that entire as soon as that forecast came up, <laughs> Evie's just sitting there. Listen, me and the rest of the snow lovers wanted at least one. I'm, we don't need I a guess blizzard. I'm okay with it in January, but I mean we're getting into the later part of February. I now know, I you're think ready a lot for of folks spring. and I think I'm not alone. I mean I, I run into a no, lot of folks out alone. there and they're like Okay, I wish we had some snow back in the middle of the winter, but now <laughs> but I'm, I'm over getting it. to the point where, hey, we're looking ahead to spring. Yeah. yeah, I get it. Thank I'm you. looking past it. I'm already into spring. <laughs> You're like, skip it all together. That's right? the S word I'm looking for. <laughs>